a gorgeous Swiss hippie chick. Friend of Opium Dragon walks in. Her name is Dolphin of the Mekong. I mean, uh, hippie chicks like name themselves after animals, uh, rainbows. Uh, you know, this is like long before of Match.com, Facebook. Uh, you kind of had to spice up your your image in person. So, uh, yeah, dolphin, gorgeous young drifter from Switzerland. She's neutral. She'll smoke anything, especially opium. Mm -hmm. And dolphin teaches English to get by to the children of the United States Embassy. And uh, infants of the CIA. Uh, but for me, this is too much boot licking to tempt me. Uh, besides, my speciality is hustling rich checks. Oh, yeah, I play to my strengths. Uh, like my cats, when in doubt, I lick my way around the world. <laughs> uh, and for a traveling partner, Rainbow, I don't know. Mm hmm. Lucky girl. Rainbow, like perfect travel partner. Mm -hmm. Just right. Tight, not uptight in the head, you know. But uh, and she doesn't work for her money anyway. She's a rich kid from Chicago. Nineteen-year-old blonde stunner. Wealthy parents, and she lives on a trust fund. She has a thick wad of American Express traveler's checks that would stuff the throat of a wildebeest. I mean, a gag. And uh, traveler's checks before credit cards. A paper, paper, um, often comes from trees, trees, um, trees are like the skyscrapers of asparagus. Uh, if you gamers came out of your bunkers, uh, ever, and looked up you would see skyscrapers of asparagus. Hmm. Look, I've been cruising the Greek islands and India back and forth, back and forth. For four years, uh, Rainbow Babe couldn't find a better guide, overland guide from my cave on Rhodos, in the Greek islands, too. Oh, way to Laos. And bodyguard. I mean, getting a, a uh, luscious female free in the head creature across the sex starved Middle East. We're talking Turkey, Iran, Pakistan. India, and they even hit up on me, especially in those steaming hammams. The, the Persian men 
try to take advantage of me by soaping me up. <laughs> you know where then? I'm too young to push those fuckers off. Um, I don't blame them. I, I sympathize with, with the uh, guys in the Middle East. I mean, you know, I'm young. Hair down to my shoulders. You know, kind of a Ringo cut. Yeah, challenging. Uh, our sex scene is clean and hot. <laughs> uh, and our drug scene is cool and rather innocent. Yeah, and Rainbow and I travel together for six months now, all the way across what I just talked about. Um, Turkey, Iran, Afghanistan, Pakistan, India, and on to Laos. <laughs> ah, we made it. <clears throat> and on to, you know, like fabulous Southeast Asia. I mean, uh, we're just getting started here. Uh, and then in six months, we've only spent $500. And we only gnawed through five of rainbows. <clears throat> Traveler's checks, the hundred dollar ones. Uh, check this out. We spend less freaking around the world, exploring our awesome planet with other free spirited young people than the average American spends. Um, Trapped in a shoebox apartment. Trapped in commuting with other uptight worker slaves to a great cubicle in a maze of hundreds of cubicles. Living a life in a soul-numbing worker-slave job. <laughs> 